Hey friends, today we're heading to the US, but not for a chill road trip. Nope, we're talking about a prison, but not just any prison. I'm taking you to the Eastern State Penitentiary or Eastern State for the insiders. This place is like the Rolls Royce of American prisons, but we're talking the 1829 model. Yeah, back when architects thought making prison cells look like a monastery would help reform criminals. So picture this, you arrive and you're completely alone, like really alone. No cellmates to chat with or play Uno in secret, just you, your thoughts and walls. It was all about silent incarceration. The idea, total isolation so you could reflect on your actions. They even gave you a hood with blinders so you wouldn't see the other prisoners. Talk about a fashion statement, huh? But wait, it gets better. The masterminds behind this place came up with the idea of soundproofing. Yep, they made sure you were so alone you could practically lose track of time. And the best part? This was supposed to heal people. Spoiler, it made more lunatics than model citizens. No wonder after years of total silence, inmates came out like, hi, I'm rehabilitated. But now I talk to my wallpaper. Oh, and here's where it gets spooky. The place is said to be haunted. Yep, apparently, some of the former inmates never quite left. Imagine strolling around the old cell blocks, and bam, you hear voices, footsteps in empty hallways, maybe even a ghostly Al Capone complaining about the poor radio reception. Some people have seen shadows sneaking around the abandoned cells. It's like, hey, hey, you want to play Ghost in Solitary too? They even run special haunted Halloween tours now. Because, of course, when you've got a prison full of lost souls, why not freak out the visitors, right? And speaking of Al Capone, yes, he did time there. But of course, he had a deluxe cell, complete with furniture, paintings, and a radio. The guy was in prison, but it was like a presidential suite. No big deal. Maybe he's still haunting his comfy little corner. Who knows? So yeah, the, the Eastern State Penitentiary is a mix of extreme spiritual retreat, mental asylum, and haunted mansion. Nowadays, it's a museum, and honestly, it's worth a visit. Are you coming? But this time with friends, right? No one wants to end up like one of the wandering spirits. And you, would you rather be in solitary or Capone's luxury cell? Let me know in the comments.